Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So for this week's Plan With Me I'm going to be using a kit from Paper Shire. We are doing a collaboration this week so she chose a kit from my shop that I sent over to her and then I received this Blossom kit which is a ginormous kit. <laughs> well it's bigger than what I've been using lately because I've just been really into mini kits. So it's really nice actually to have plenty of stickers to choose from. But I'm going to be using the washi along the bottom first and I just centered it in my planner. I am using a, a Erin Condren life planner. I was about to say happy planner. <laughs> uh, so my boxes are a little bit bigger than the standard Erin Condren's and the happy planner. I also pulled in my own poppet date covers as there wasn't any date covers with the kit and I thought the pastel colours went really well with the rest of the kit in the flowers and all sorts. So now I am just going to put the headers along the top which just says today the whole way across and then we'll be going in day by day. So the first thing that I'm putting down is one of the poppets from the pack lunch sheet as I needed to remember to give everyone their pet lunches. There's a couple of incidents happen now <laughs> when my children go off, they've either forgotten their lunchbox or I've forgotten my lunchbox when I go off to work. So first thing Monday morning, I put that down to remind myself. Underneath there, I've put a little label and a little clock pop it down as I needed to remember that we're leaving at eight in the morning. And then underneath there, I'm putting my little to-do section. As I've got lots of stickers, I decided to use stickers to write things down so instead of writing them down on my planner I'm going to be writing them all on these little appointment labels. So the first one is um, I had to go to Tesco's so after I dropped my son at school and my other half off to work I was going to Tesco's to pick a couple of bits up which is a huge mistake because as we all are well aware uh, there's nothing left <laughs> so um, that happened. Um, so once I had got home after work I had a look online to see if I would be able to get anything that I needed online. They're out of stock online as well, so that was a bit pointless. But I just wrote all those down on appointment labels and just used a couple of puppets for them. And then me and my son have been watching something called The Silence on Netflix, and we were going to be finishing it on Monday night, but we have got like 20 minutes left, so we'll be finishing that actually tonight. And then I just filled it up with a full box. And then moving over to Tuesday, I started with a floral page flag, which is so pretty. And then on top of that, I put one of the like little worried poppets as obviously we had the coronavirus update and everyone's probably fed up with talking about the coronavirus, but it was the update that over 70s uh, need to isolate and people with health conditions, you know, I'm sure you've heard the update. Um, so I've just marked that in my planner up at the top and then I moved on to my work section and blocked off a lot of time with a full box because obviously I'll be working. And then underneath there I'm putting three appointment labels. Well, these ones are to mark your dinners, but I'm going to be covering up the icons so it, it didn't matter what icon was on there. And I've just taken some of the poppets from the tiny sheet as they're like a really good size for the appointment labels. And this was to mark down that I needed to film, edit and do my voiceover because yet again, I didn't have time over the weekend to film my plan with me. So I'm having to do it all today again. And then right at the bottom there, I've just used a half box with a little peekaboo poppet and writing upload. So hopefully this video is still going to go up on time. I'm looking at the time now and it's like a little race against the clock. <laughs> on Friday, I started off with a full box up at the top. And then I'm just marking down here that I want to call my nan. Obviously, she's over 70, so she's going to be self-isolating. So I'm going to be making sure I call her every other day. And we'll also be sending her some things in the mail and stuff. Anyway. Uh, I used one of the pretty scalloped labels to write down to design and then I was marking this down to post orders but I wrote it upside down as I needed to flip it the other way. So I just rewrote it on another one and then used one of my Happy Mail puppets. And then here I'm just using a small checklist as I want to do some printing and cutting and all that kind of thing. And then lastly I will want to do some housework so I just took one of my new house doodle icons and marked that down. For Thursday, I will be making another phone call. So my aunt, well, we call her Auntie Faye. It's actually my nan's sister. So obviously she's self-isolating as well. They both live on their own as well. So I will be making sure I call them. Well, it'll be every single day, but it will be one day my nan, one day my Auntie Faye. I don't know why I'm explaining my life to you but anyway uh, so I'll be calling her. So and then um, I need my children to do homework. I want to design again. I've got some laundry that I'll need to catch up on. 
and then I just want to like have a rest with a cup of coffee and updating my bullet journal. I put my full box down at the bottom and then I remembered that I will need to put some petrol in the car. And then moving over to Friday, again, I'm just putting a load of the appointment labels down. The top one is going to be for me to catch up with all of my emails. So I just used a PC pop it. That time of the month is coming up again. So I just used one of the shark poppets and I need to make sure that I've got my release ready for the Saturday. Underneath that, I put my full box and then again, I'm putting another half box to remember to call my nan. And we'll also be sending my nan and my auntie Faye things in the post at least once a week from the kids, drawings, cards, letters, that kind of thing. So I've just put a happy mail pop it down at the bottom on a half box to mark for that and then for the weekend on the Saturday I've put a full box up at the top and then a half box with just like a mental health check-in situation because you can't go around helping everybody if you yourself just need to take five minutes and chill so I've marked that down for me just to like you know zone in on myself for a second and then I can help everyone else a week again next week um, I need to somehow try and do a food shop so I'm not sure how that's going to go yet but I'm in the same boat as everybody else so whatever happens we shall all figure it out together. Um, on the Sunday I want my children to do homework. It's like routine as usual here until the school's shut in my area so we're still doing homework and reading and all that kind of thing so I've marked that down in my planner. I've put down for me to film next week's plan with me. Hopefully I'll be able to actually do that this weekend because I feel like I can spend more time on a spread and voiceover and editing etc. Well hopefully you guys haven't really noticed that it's been in a rush lately because that wouldn't be very nice. And then for my sidebar, it's the same as it always is. It has two habit trackers, a this week section. I have added a dinner section. So if I am scrambling for meal ideas or able to get anything, at least I can kind of plan out some meals, kind of. I don't know, but that's what I've done. I also forgot it was Mother's Day on the Sunday, so I've marked that down. Although I don't think we'll really be doing anything for Mother's Day this year. So here's everything that I've got left. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos and I hope wherever you are, you and your family are all safe. Hope you guys have enjoyed this week's video. If you did, then make sure you give me a thumbs up and I will speak to you all next time. To become a part of our Puppet family, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel. If you want to be notified for my uploads, then just hit the bell icon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.